Welcome to Moomoo Math and Science. In this video, let's talk about ratios. A ratio is just simply how much one thing there is compared to another. For example, and in this video, we'll start with some very basic ones and then we'll move to one a little more challenging. Okay, what is the ratio of dogs to cats? Well, if you count the number of dogs, we have one, two, three, we have four dogs, and you can write it in fraction form, and we have three, four, five, we have six cats. And just like a fraction, you can simplify it. Two goes into four two times, goes into six three times. So there's a couple ways you can write a ratio. It is two to three, or you can write it literally two, two, three, or you can write it with a colon two, two, three. So there would be the ratio of dogs to cats. Let's take a look at another one. With this next example, we have what is the ratio of apples to oranges? Well, if you count the number of apples, you have six apples, and we'll write it first in fraction form, and then you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve oranges. So remember, you can simplify this, and so I'm going to simplify it. Uh, six actually goes into both of them, so it would be one half. Or if you would like, you can write it one. 2, 2, or like this. All of those would work for a ratio. Now let's work one that's a little bit more challenging, but it's the same concepts. Okay, we have Smith Middle School has 125 sixth graders and 200 seventh graders. What is the ratio of seventh graders to six, sixth graders to seventh graders? Well, let's write it in fraction form. So we have 125 over 200. And we can simplify. 25 goes into both of these. 25 goes into 125 five times. And it goes into 200 eight times. And remember, we can write this 5, 2, 8. Or 5, colon, 8. So there we go. Basics of ratios. I hope this helps. And remember, kindness multiplies kindness. Be kind to someone today.